Hello, and welcome back to Stranded Deep, Episode 6. When we left off, we were enjoying this beautiful sunrise next to our fire after just eating some fresh crab and drinking some fresh water for the first time well, since our plane went down. It was glorious. I guess that's not true. We had fresh water from the uh, solar still that we had poured inside hollow coconuts, but to be fair, it just tasted like coconut milk by the time I ended up drinking it. So, you know, I'm going to go ahead and throw that in there. Let's, let's put this fire out. It's not needed. Um, I'm going to save the game. I'm not sure if the save is just to continue or if, um, you know, they give you a serious permanent death um, when you die and the save is, is no good once you die. I don't know that, but I'm going to save as often as I can. Things we're not going to take with us are sticks, nor rocks, um, the tarp, yes, lashings, sure, drinkable coconut has a serving in it, we're going to take that, the bucket, the spear, wonderful. Now, now we can go sailing. Uh, since I have the room, I'm going to go ahead and carry these, I was just going to leave them in the raft, but I don't see a reason to do that as long as I have the room. I don't see anything in that direction. Okay, so that's east. North? Well, wouldn't that be where I came? That would... That would have to be... That's where I came from. That's the big island I came from because I, I skirted around these rocks. That's what it was. That was the... That far off island would be the very first one I landed on. This is my next target. Okay, what's the what's the weather say for today? Rain? Oof, and I hear shark sounds, but we're going. I don't care. We're going to... We're going to sail. I never intended to stay on this island for more than a day. And I don't know what the lifespan of this raft is. We're going to use it while we have it. Oof. Oof, the sea state's a little high today. Oh my. Okay, alright. That's that's okay. Oof, oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, so it's a little... Uh, yeah, it's a little wavy out here today. Oh. That's alright. That's alright. The island doesn't appear to be too far. Oh, it does appear to be small, but we've, we've got this. We can do this. Oh, I'm sure that noise means that we have sharks in the vicinity. I'm not going to let that frighten me. Oh, look, this island is closer? Or is this part of the same island system? Oh, this looks to be part of the same system. Oh, yep, okay. We had a little bit of a a little bit of latency there as the uh, the area rendered. Oh my! Oh my! Oh, well, we've definitely uh, definitely have our gamble paying off. Look at this place. Oh my! This is great. Oh, this is, this is absolutely wonderful. <gasps> There's rocks. There's rocks. Okay. All right. Let's, uh, let's stay, stay clear of the rocks. Ooh, I think I might've hit something. Oof, or it was a wave. Oh my. The waves. The sea state is, oh, is a little high today. This isn't a very shallow beach. Okay, let's, let's get out and let's drag this ashore. Oh man, I bet there's good stuff here. So all of these are ships. That looked like a building when I first saw it. I mean, it is kind of a ship of the building. Oh, this is... This is phenomenal. Excellent. Bunch of rocks. <gasps> you know what there isn't here, though? Coconuts. There are like no coconut trees here. Oh no. There are no 
palm trees here. Okay. Then, then, then we need a bucket. Then we need a bucket bad now. Unless we're not going to stay here long. Oh, well, we're pretty hydrated. I guess there's no reason to panic yet. Let's see what's up here. A whole lot of nothing. It's not letting me really interact with any of this. Some broken stairs. An old drum? Here we go. What do we have in here? Oh. Oh, it stinks. God. Ugh, okay. Okay. And this door doesn't open. Ooh, a whole lot of zero. A whole lot of waste of my time. Come on, there's got to be good stuff in here, right? There's got to be. Look at this thing. Man, this place is like the, the boat graveyard. Treacherous seas. And those rocks, that's exactly... There's nothing in these upstairs. I don't know if there's like a hole in the bottom I can go in downstairs. Maybe under, under, under the deck. No. Ugh. What a waste. But this is exactly what I didn't want to do with my raft. Run onto some rocks. What do we have? Nothing here either. There we go. Yes. Yes. An engine component. The one I already have, too. Number one of four parts of an engine. Anything of value? Oh, hello. Empty. Ah. That's... That's so disappointing. I get all excited. And it's empty. Well, let's check back behind you here. What do you what do you have behind you over here? Um No, it's not gonna oh there it goes. Yes, it let me back here. Oh, but I can't interact with any of it. Okay, fair enough. Did I hear something? It sounded like I heard something. Hold on a second. Perhaps it was just a bird. So, if my memory serves me of the map, yes, the east should be a huge island. It's only 11. If we get underway, we could be there... We could be there by the next day. I, th I think that's what we need to do. So let's let's explore this last little little ship here, and then we're gonna go. We're gonna go to the next island. The the big one across the way is the one I really wanted to check out. If I remember from the map, it had like a, a neat lagoon. Could be a nice uh, uh, carburetor. Looks like this is gonna be another engine part. I'm gonna go ahead and say we don't need two of this one. Part number four of four. Oh, a machete. Oh, well then. Um, well, no, let's let's keep the coconut. Yeah, let's keep the coconut. Let's get rid of the lashing. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, it's four. Yeah, whatever. We're taking the machete. That's a thing. And another carburetor. Hmm. Well, the other the other boats had nothing. This one's full of good stuff. Strong cutting tool, good durability, useful for chopping trees. Imagine that's going to be better. Oh, another bucket! Yes, of course, another bucket. Two buckets. I love it. Now we're going to boil. We'll be boiling our own water before long watch. 
Okay. I think that's fair enough, or that's enough for now. It says rain predicted for today. That's that's what it says, rain cloud. I don't know. I don't see anything like that. Let me give uh Hmm, we're filling up on stuff though. Would it be wise to just go back go back to our base? Drop off these engine parts. Uh, but we're so close. I took uh, I took this route because I didn't want to sail diagonal. I felt like that would be so much time at sea that something bad could happen. So I've kind of been sailing the most direct route um, for my own island. Look at this, more ships. Oh. I'm trying not to think about it, but I want to know what's on them. Mm. We can't hang out on this island for too long. I don't want to stay the night here. We don't have any coconuts here. Uh, no. No. Uh, no. No. Nope. We can't. And it's twofold. It's not just because of the, you know, the risk of going out there in the water because eventually I'm going to have to and I, and I know that, I know that I'm just trying to get my confidence under my belt now the reason I'm saying no is because ultimately I'm going to want to come back to this island anyways maybe at some point or am I uh, my inventory's full I need to head back uh, no no, we're going to the new island I, I'm Crippled with indecision, but that's what we're going to do. We're going to uh, hop out of this thing. We're going to drag it around where we can get away from some of these rocks. And we're going to travel to the large island to our east because the sun should be setting in the west, so that should be it. It doesn't look as... Uh, Did something pop up? Oh no, there it is. It doesn't it doesn't seem as large as I remember seeing it on the map. Oh, maybe it is. Or should I just go back? You know what? We're gonna go back. Just as soon as we get over this sandbar. Come on. Come on, we're going back. I'm gonna drop off cause cause the thing of it is my inventory is full. And that's... Oh, a rock! I need to get away from this island. Oh, there's more rocks out here. Oh, okay, they're going to make me go around these rocks. Oh, man. It's better to go around them than to get hit by them, right? I can still see my island. It's the big one in the distance there. So we'll just stay steady as the course. Um, steady on the course, rather. And we'll just go. We'll just head out. Ooh, ooh, there's some rocks underneath us here. Oh, man, this whole area is treacherous. Look, you can see them breaking the surface. <gasps> oh, I'm just going to keep going. So it's not all, not all deep out here. Not at all. Quite a bit of shallow water. Hmm, I can see coral underneath me. I don't I don't want to think I just need to go. Just need to go. And here comes the rain. Ah, that's going to affect visibility, I'm sure. Just please don't be a bad storm. Oh no, this is okay, this is just a sun shower. Stay the course. Stay the course. Oh, but the water is dark now. I'm not going to be able to see the rocks. <sighs> this is okay. It's okay. It's just a little bit of rain. It's just a little bit of rain from a big cloud. The waves are light. The wind is light. That's really what matters. There we go. I think that little lag means the island populated up ahead. That means we're getting close. I don't know why it keeps telling me jump to climb. 
I'm not climbing out of anything. I'm just going to keep on going. What's happening? Okay, that's scary. That really scared me, that little bit of latency there. Ugh. I don't need... I don't need surprises like that. I don't need surprises like that at all. Okay, that's... Let's... Let's do enough of that. Mm. <laughs> okay. Alright, we're practically here. Look at this. Look at this. Sail on the water and a little bit of rain. No big deal. NBD. Mm. I didn't doubt I'd make it for a second. <laughs> Oh, this is great. Okay, we'll pull you up out of the water. Wonderful. Now. Oh, look at this. Another fruit of a different kind. That's good, I like that. That means the wild plants regrow at a good rate. Also, I'll be able to grow a different kind of crop now. Oh, I love it. Alright, so we're going to put down the carburetor. I want to make sure this was the same part. One of four. Yeah, it looked like it. I just, for some reason, I thought it was, uh, I thought it was four of four. I, I got really confused. It doesn't matter. And another jerry can. This is really neat. I'll be able to make a, an actual engine here soon, eventually. At least I'm hoping. How's my condition faring? I'm a little hungry. I'm pretty thirsty. I'm getting slightly tired. Oh, look at this. It's already bearing fruit. Nice and wet from the rain. Wow. That's really great. Mm, let's, let's hold off on that. Let me... Let's get this bucket here. Oh, oh, the bucket had water in it. Okay. Empty bucket, four servings. A fresh water. This says empty. It doesn't look empty. Bucket of fresh water from the rain. Oh, I guess they do fill up from the rain. That's magnificent. That's so wonderful. It really is. Oh. I love it so much. So, so much. Oh no, don't spill it. <gasps> I did spill it, didn't I? Oh my goodness. Carefully place the buckets down from now on. <laughs> I swear. Well, you know what? We'll just fill this thing up with this. Yep. We'll take all that water out of the solar still, and we'll very gently place the bucket down. Fresh water. Crops. Um, I actually want to make more. I want to make an. I want to plant this other. Uh, this other crop here. That's that's what I'm gonna do. Oh yeah, I know. I've got to have the. Uh, got to have the hoe in my possession. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm, corrugated no let's just for just for fun let's make them out of planks we could make them look all samey but uh, I don't know they're different fruit maybe we'll make the same fruit out of the same stuff so we'll do the the kuawa fruit I, I, I knew I wasn't gonna I'm sure that's not how you pronounce it. I'll, I'll do that fruit in the corrugated metal, and then we'll do the other fruit in the planks. Because there are a lot of planks uh, on this island. Alright, I, I say that, and now I can't seem to find any of them. Although it is getting dark. I'm sure that it has something to do with it. Oh, look at that moonrise. Yeah, it's getting dark. I should have brought the lamp. Like a knucklehead. I did not. Uh, is that some? Mm, that looks like that might be some over there. 
I'm not sure though. Mm, tarp. Oh, another tarp. Yeah, let's get the lamp. We don't have that moonlight yet. All right. So we'll pick you up and bring you with us. That's what we'll do. So we get some of that moonlight. We need a little bit of help. It's awful dark in the moon's shadow. Didn't I already gather some... Come on, moon. Didn't I already gather some planks together? Maybe not. This is impossible. I'd have to be right up on it to see it with this lamp. Oh, wait a minute. Here's something. Oh, driftwood. More driftwood. Okay, we're starting to get some moonlight. Finally. Slowly but surely. Should have left this inside the house. I'll never get it to friggin' stand up straight again. Still waiting on some more of that moonlight now. Guess I could go search the part of the island that's illuminated, right? sure why it's so dark. It did this a time before. It almost feels like this should all be lit up by now. That's so peculiar. So peculiar. You know what we can do? We can... Oh, I can't see anything. Well, that's... That's a little, uh... A little bizarre. But look, it's all lit up over here. And look, it's going away as I get close to it. Interesting. <sighs> okay. Let's try a fire. Let's see what a fire does. Maybe that'll maybe that'll set things straight. Plus, you know, we want a fire. We want something that's gonna be visible in case somebody flies overhead. I still have the flare, but I feel like a fire every night is a good idea. Mm. That's still only helped marginally. It really looks like the moon is... Ugh. Should be illuminating all this is what it looks like. And it's not, I don't think, because look, as I try to run towards the area that's lit up, it's getting darker. So I think what we're dealing with is a, uh, is a full-blown, uh, glitch. I, I didn't want to call it that at first, but I'm pretty confident that that is, that is the case indeed. So here's what we'll do. We're going to do a quick little reset of the game. Uh, I'll be back in, um, oh, well, let me... Let me save my game real quick. And uh, we're not going to wrap anything up yet, but I I'm going to be right back. It'll be just a moment for you. Stand by. All right. <clears throat> here, here we are. We're back again, as you can see. Things are a little different. The bug is fixed. Um, what actually ended up happening was I recorded about six more minutes after the bug was fixed. And uh, the audio was really messed up, so unfortunately we lost those six minutes. So I'm just going to recap what I did. Uh, I built a smoker over my fire pit. I ran around, I gathered some of the tarp and sticks. I pretty much had the stuff for it. And then I built a second, um, a second plot over here. I still don't like the way you can't see them until you're up close, but I, I put the Kura fruit that I had in this plot with planks. And that was really all I did in the last six minutes was I built those two things. Um, so we're going to go ahead and run around and do a little bit uh, more gathering off the beaches here for a few minutes. And then and then we still need to wrap up uh, this episode, episode 6. Um, apologize for the, uh, 
bit of issues. Really though, it's it's difficult to avoid when playing these early release games to be able to support these developers as they make this uh, new genre, this survival genre, really, really come alive. Um, and what I think I'm going to do is we're going to get us a crab. There we go. And then we're going to put it in the smoker. We're going to take it out. We're going to smoke it. Or uh, pull the meat out of the shell, and then we're going to smoke it. We're going to utilize this this new thing. Mmm, sunrise. So I wanted to travel today, too. I won't know what the weather is till the sun comes up. So let's go ahead and get us some smoked crab meat. No! Give me my spear. How about you pull the crab off the end, thank you, and then throw him down. Nope, throw him down. He's so hungry, he just keeps picking him back up. Uh, there we are, the knife. Yes. Oh, he's, oh, okay. That that didn't work out how I imagined. I think next time I need to crouch and <laughs> help, it, help it look a little better. And the smoker. And crab meat. No! Oh, I always do that. I ate it. Raw. Ugh. So disappointing. Well, let's go get another crab then, I suppose. How are these buckets doing? There we go. Bucket of fresh water. And I think he's empty. That was all he had. Empty bucket. Bucket of fresh water. Yep. Ugh, I love it. Drinking that rainwater. Excellent. <sighs> this might be a day to travel. It says it's a sunny day. Yeah, I wanna get I wanna get going. I wanna travel for sure. We're gonna leave the buckets here. We're gonna grab some coconuts. Leave the things we don't need. And then we're gonna get ready to go to another island. I kind of, kind of sad that I dorked up the, <laughs> the smoker yet again, but what are you gonna do? I don't want to sit here and what's this drinkable coconut will save you. You can go here. Just start putting all our stuff in here. We're gonna need the hammer and totally stay. I think we'll keep the antibiotics and the flare gun. We don't need to keep, uh, we don't need to hold on to this stuff though. The, uh, the tool, the hose can stay out here. And then the rocks. Probably going to find rocks wherever we're headed. Don't need those. What I do need are coconuts. And then we're going to leave all these engine parts and this fuel behind. Empty, and this is empty. And... That's empty. Okay, so we're going to fill these up with water before we leave. Which is really neat. I like that you can do that. You kind of get the... Uh... Okay, now. One serving. Zero servings. Maybe I can come over here. There we go. One serving. Zero servings. One, one, zero. Nope, they're all empty now. Okay, that's fine. All right, and that's that's been about six minutes, so we are going to go ahead and wrap up the episode. Um, again, sorry about the issues. That's uh, there's really nothing that we can do to avoid it. Um, I'm going to try to minimize its impact as much as possible, though, and be on the lookout for issues like that. And uh, we're going to set up to travel. So hopefully uh you see you next time episode seven when our plan is to hit the large island in the southeast with a lagoon look you can see the little shipwreck cove there i want to go to the island that's between the two and further out all right so this has been stranded deep episode six thank you so much for joining me and um i hope you had fun because i know i did so take care <laughs>